What's up guys, today we are gonna destroy the Luca planet. To unlock that new planet, we are gonna have to destroy every water-based planet starting with Neptune. This is a giant. As you guys may or may not know, this planet actually regenerates, it kind of regrows itself. Look, we got a whole lot of missiles and they deal a tiny little bit of damage. And then it just grows back. But we are gonna destroy this and we're gonna destroy every other water planet to unlock the Luca planet. Guys, leave a like on the video before this thing explodes in three, two, one. Come on, a rocket. I thought you were gonna explode a little faster. Boom, yes! Whoa! Wait, what? Oh, of course. Wait, the, the shield. The shield is inside of the planet. Wait, what? That shows you how big this planet really is because the shield is inside of the planet. But it was just around the whole planet of Earth. Yeah, that looks very nice. It is regrowing pretty slowly, but let's see if the shield can help us out, huh? So we're gonna grab the ice laser. Normally, this cannot destroy a planet, but this time it can. And it even goes through the shield. Are you guys seeing that? It's like the shield doesn't do anything. Now, what happens when we use a regular laser? Does that still work? Wait, what? How does that go through the shield? Guys, did we break it? I think we broke it already. That's pretty fast. All right, Kevin, come over here. I forgot your name, Kevin, but you guys post a lot of comments. Thank you so much. Kevin is his name. I forgot, but this time we know his name and it's Kevin. Kevin the Kraken. <laughs> Whoa, and Kevin is hungry today. Oh my goodness, look at that bite. Nope, wait, hold on, hold on. It is regrowing, but it's not regrowing to the same size that it was before. But guys, I think it's time to destroy this one. So let's grab the big boy laser. There we go, right through the center. There is no way you can recover from that. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Ew! That looks kind of gross, though. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well, it just regrew the whole thing. Oh, look at the shield. Now, it's not quite as big compared to the planet. That means the planet is shrinking. And if it shrinks just a little bit more, just like that. Look, now it's all inside of the shield, right? See? We can see it shrinking. Oh, this is great. Because that means we are destroying it. And that also means... We're getting closer to that secret Luca planet. And now that this thing is inside of the shield, I want to try the rockets again to see if this time they get blocked. Does that work? They are flying. Come on. Wait, they pass right through. Someone broke my force field thing. That means we're going to have to try something. All right. We're going to set this to 66. Then we're going to go into the aim mode. And then we're going to fire away to fly an actual jet. Like a spaceship space cruiser space flying thing whatever we're gonna fly it through the shield is that possible huh? how would that happen what huh? what is going on over here yo i am bamboozled to the maximum <laughs> what okay we're gonna try and fly through it again how is this possible guys i can't believe this okay you know what we're just gonna shoot at the planet and dig ourselves a nice tunnel come on keep digging oh no wait we got another one Take two, everyone. Oh, a lot of fire. A lot of fire. Oh, it's not quite working, is it? Wait, can we just keep on going? Can we just keep on going? Hold on. Hold on. I think we can. Okay, well, that was just weird. Anyway, the planet did shrink a little bit. And the color over here is kind of, uh, uh kind of brownish. That's brown and blue at the same time. Brownish. Oh, but I know how we're going to destroy it. Wait, hold on. Oh, I thought it got bounced off the shield. But it just bounced off the planet. Wait, and it restores the color. Wait, what's going on over here, man? That's so weird. Oh, do we have, like, low gravity on this planet? I think that's what's going on. I love the sound, though. Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> Look at all these bombs flying all over the place. Wait a minute, I just realized something. Don't we have, like, a secret cube planet? Yeah, we do, and it's got all water. Wait, there's a locked planet. But that was a ghost world, right? What happened to the ghost world? Why is it gone? All right, that was a little bit strange. Anyway, let's continue with this minefield. Oh, yes. Wow, they're flying all over the place. This is crazy. Now, normally, this would be way more bombs to cover the entire planet. Way more than you need. Way, way too many. But because this new planet is absolutely ginormous, we can place down 
way more of these things. Now, last time we tried on a small planet, if you guys are subscribed to my channel, you know what happened. It wasn't pretty. Everything broke and it turned into a giant fireball. Actually, that last part was pretty cool. <laughs> but this time, I can imagine that my computer, which is, you know, I'm playing it on my computer. I think it's gonna melt a little bit, just like the planet and just like the Luca planet. Ooh. So now, let's detonate all these bombs by sending this to the maximum amount of rockets, but I am gonna reduce the power. That's because it doesn't matter. It's gonna explode so big, it's just gonna, you know, annihilate the planet. Three, two, one, hold on to your phone, tablet, computer, television, whatever it is you're watching on, and... Come on now, come on now, oh, what? How did not a single bomb explode? Okay, you know what? I thought it was big brain. Not at all. But I went from big brain to big boom. Because this is enough power to annihilate any planet in the universe. Come on, I want to see it. Big screen time. Whoa. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my goodness, is my computer okay? All right, there's a little bit of fire coming out of it, but that's fine. Wow. Wait, what is that for a thing over there? What is this over here? Uh-oh. More rockets, apparently. I didn't say more rockets, but the game is like, yeah, James, I know what you like. <laughs> more rockets. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. They're spinning in the center. All right, are they going to explode? Come on, man. You got one job. There you go. All right, thank you. How in the world is this planet still alive? You know what? We're going to use the... Wait, the ice laser doesn't work on the core of the planet. Oh, well, that's kind of weird. Well, I bet this thing is gonna work. There we go. That is the first planet annihilated. Which means it's time to move on to the next, which is the cube. We're gonna place the shield inside of the planet. Just a nice tiny cube. Then we're gonna use the frost laser to freeze all of the water on the cube planet. We are not going to touch any of the other regular land places, you know? You know, the stuff that you live on. <laughs> People living on the water be like, hey, wait a minute, that's kind of rude. I know, but you know, why are you living on water anyway? Wait, hold on, is there two billion people living on water? How is that even possible? Are those all sailors? Or like pirates or something? I think so. All right, I can't see anything over here though. It's so dark. Can't the sun like move on a little bit? There you go. Speed it up, son. Wait, can we hit the sun? Wait, you can hit the sun with a frost laser. Okay, we're gonna have to... <gasps> Is that how we gotta destroy this and unlock the Luca planet? I think so. All right, we're gonna freeze the bottom, which is kind of frozen already, you know? Then we're gonna freeze all of this stuff. There we go. Good job, son. Thank you for providing light and life. Yes, you know, photosynthesis and stuff, right? That's... I don't know. I didn't pay much attention to biology class. And we're gonna freeze this over here. I think that's America, right? Yo, if you're in America, it's cold right now. <laughs> Super cold. There we go. Beautiful. Very nice. I think that is everything. So now we're gonna annihilate everything with a whole bunch more rockets. Then we're gonna freeze the sun and see if that can destroy the planet even with the shield and gauge. But now you will see because this is such a small planet. Oh boy, it's gonna do a lot of damage. Wait, 600... 500 million people survived that? That means 493 million people have got some kind of shelter, like a bomb shelter. I don't. I'm in the attic right now. There is no sheltering here. If this strikes the earth, I am done for. God, so finito. <laughs> what? Is there a cube? <gasps> Whoa, look at that cube. Oh, it's glowing. Oh, please tell me it's not gonna explode. Do we do too much? Wow, look at that. So the shield is working. Oh, look at planet. I am so on my way right now. I am ready to rumble. <gasps> oh, please tell me that's not too much. Is that it? Please survive. Please survive. Please survive. Oh, wait, what? How though? It's a perfect cube. All right, you know what? We've got a little bit of garbage around here. We can get rid of that, no problem, right? And let's use green because Alberto's favorite color is green and we gotta honor him a little bit, you know? We we gotta get him that shout out. You know, Alberto is Luca's best friend and they met and stuff and, and, you know, no spoilers. But yeah, there it is, beautiful. So now let's go ahead and use the ice laser on the moon. On the moon? That giant fireball is called the sun, James. Come on, do we a dummy now? <laughs> oh, that's a big glowing cube. Big glowing cube. Come on. I want to see a Luca planet. Wait, I forgot about one. I forgot about a planet. Okay, you know what? We're going to watch this explode. There we go. Whoa. Oh, wait, what? W water. Water planet unlocked. Oh, look. It's right over there. Wait, what? No way, guys. Look at this planet. 
It is entirely made out of water. That is exactly what Luca would love, of course. Oh, and we can freeze it. No way. This kind of looks like a giant eyeball looking right into my soul. Yeah, stop looking at me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what if we freeze the whole thing? Before we do that, I want to see what the rockets can do to water. No, wait. I know something way better. The moon. <gasps> yes. What? There's fire inside of this planet. I thought the whole thing was made out of water. Oh, maybe that's why we gotta freeze it. World's the biggest, the giantiest, the iciest planet coming right on, people. Would you like some ketchup with that? Maybe some sambal? No, thank you. I'll take this planet. Nice and frozen. That made absolutely no sense. I don't know. Was that a joke? I just, I don't know. Okay. I do know one thing. This whole water planet is gonna turn into an ice ball that we're gonna destroy it and unlock that lookout planet, which is Gotta unlock this, right? Come on now. There we go. Nice and freezy, nice and frozy. I love it. Hey, son, get out of here, man. You're unfreezing my planet. We need to build a giant refrigerator so we can keep this nice and cool, you know? I think we need uh, the, the coolest refrigerator in the world, which is probably called a freezer. <laughs> Look at this place, though. We can't even freeze this patch, can we? Yeah, no, we can't. That's the no-no place, everyone. Don't freeze the no-no place. Oh, 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 we gotta freeze this one. Beautiful. We turned the water planet into an ice planet, which technically is still a water planet. Just kind of frozen and stuff. But I think this is gonna be fun to destroy. And we're gonna destroy it with a black hole. Where's that opening? Right over here. Black hole going into the planet. Oh, yes. That's how you destroy something, right? <gasps> Big damage. Big damage, guys. Oh, wait. There's another cube inside. Do you guys see that? It's like one side, another side, one side over here. Oh. Beautiful. But now if we go to the other side. Wait, there's no hole here. Unacceptable, I say. So we're gonna go ahead and smack the whole place with a big lightning storm. This has gotta be one of the most powerful things in the game, right? Oh my goodness, that just smashed half the planet. And now there's a tiny little hole right over here. Just like really tiny. Uh-oh, uh-oh, that's not good. Oh, wait, hold on. I did not mean to get all the zappies in there, man. Come on now, I wanted to get the dragon going. But I think we can still do that because this planet is strong. Oh my goodness. Do you guys think that's because it's all made out of ice? Does that make it stronger? I guess ice is stronger than water, right? I mean, I can punch water. I cannot punch ice. That is, that is unpunchable. Oh, and this is beautiful. Going through the planet. Just like that. No way. Are we gonna crash? Go down a little bit. Ah! Keep firing! Keep firing! Oh no! My dragon! Oh, so sad. Rest in peace, dragon. Oh, that's kind of sad, right? No, not really. Because we can get way more dragons in here. Yeah! That's how you destroy a little planet. Get the Luca planet in here. Come on, guys. This is for Luca, okay? You gotta help me out. I'm so glad we've got these dragon friends. They are good people, all right? Dragon friends is good people. That's right. Don't go for the cube, though, buddy. That cube is unbreathable. Because you can't breathe on it, you know, dragon's breath. Oh, wait, he's swimming towards us. Is this swimming or flying? Whoa, bleh. <laughs> okay, that was kind of creepy. And I mean, we gotta get the ghost in here. You guys know if we... Hello? Where's the ghost? Oh, there they are. Jeez, they're kind of slow today. But you guys know it wouldn't be a Solar Smash episode without some of those purple boys, right? Come on. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Don't punch the square, though. It's gonna hurt, okay? It's, it's unpunchable and unbreathable and on everything, I guess. Oh, wait. It is sunnable. Because if you destroy the sun, it does get destroyed. Now, let's finish this one off with the nuclear bomb. Just after we throw a bunch of moons at it. Guess, oh, it's so beautiful, right? Oh, I love the moons. <laughs> wait, what? He just bounces off the cube. Wait, that's right. We never threw a moon at something that is indestructible. All right, let's see. Is the cube moonable? No, it is definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> nice try, moon. Nice try, my man. Wait, hold on. Wait, is this moon chasing that other moon? Maybe they are boyfriend and girlfriend, huh? <laughs> that moon took zero damage. And I was just gonna float around in space for eternity. All right, cube. Let's see if you are laserable with the most powerful laser the universe has ever known. Oh, yes. We've got an orange sun, orange planet, orange cube, orange cursor. And now... An orange laser. Oh, this is gonna be a Luca planet unlock, right? Oh, it's glowing. Oh, I like that it's glowing because it's gotta do a boom boom, right? Come on. Three, two, 
One. One and a death. Oh. oh, we got. No, wait a minute. Look, our planet unlocked. Oh, yes. Oh, that's it. That's it. Where, where is it though? Where is it? Wait, there it comes. There it is, guys. That's gotta be the Luca Planet. That is absolutely awesome. If you guys want to see more of Luca, subscribe and enable notifications. Thank you guys for watching and check out these videos. I screen right now.